Hi, have you ever watched someone play the guitar and thought, I wish I could do that? Or met someone really fit and thought, I wish I was that fit? Or even looked at the books on your bookshelf at home and thought, I wish I could finish some of those books. Most people have so many things that they want to do, but they don't have the time, the space, or the freedom. Recently, I coined the term everything people. They are the ones who get to do everything that they want to do. If they want to get fit, they do that. If they want to learn a new language, they do that. If they want to read more, they do that. They do all of that while perhaps having a full-time job, being a mother, studying further, or tending to old parents at home. So why do they do what they do? Simply because they get a sense of fulfillment that is unmatched. To give you an example of an everything person, last year I quit a full-time job to be an author, leadership coach, and co-founder of Yomarebi Hospitality Consulting. I've always wanted to teach and since I went solo last year, I did that too. So far, I've authored two books. I've also performed in a rock band and enjoy dancing western ballroom. Additionally, I read two books a day. The lockdowns have been the most constructive things to have happened. I got my second book out to the public and I've also started work on my third. I have been conducting online leadership sessions and I've also launched a YouTube channel. I got back to teaching music to beginners and intermediates as well. The best part is that I am married to an everything person who is currently manning my camera. So how do I do all of this? Join us for our next episode to find out how everything people do just about everything they want to and perhaps you will meet some of them.